shit is all different now, man. It's all different now, man. It's all different now, man. Back then, they used to pay homage for paving the way, for making it easier to do what they do now. But what they do now, they run their mouth. But you know what? Let's go ahead and let's talk about it, man. And now, you haven't been in Chicago in a while, right? In a while. It's been a while. And, you know, this is like one of my favorite places to come. You know, I know a lot of people. Shout out to Shauna out here. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, shout out to um, our people's bacon, okay. everybody. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you know, Chicago is it. Twister, everybody. You know, it's just, it's, it's just good to be here because it's been a minute. I know. We know you want to fix that whole, how the whole Biggie relationship yeah. was portrayed on a notorious You know what's thing. crazy? I get offered movies uh, from the biggest of the biggest directors. I'm not saying I'm turning them down, but, you know, when the time is right, you know, a movie like what I want to make is going to take a couple of years to green light, and, you know what I mean, just to get it right mm-hmm. and um, have everybody tell the right story. I think a lot of people, I think even including the boys, you know what I mean, I can't really speak for season all of them, but I think if we talk to a lot of people who were there, Big Just, he's mm-hmm. Un's brother who started... Unto, who started mm-hmm. yeah who started the junior mm-hmm. mafia with, with and Biggie. who started on mm. with big this is one of the brothers and we all know that that movie it's not it mm-hmm. <laughs> we know there's a but lot like watching that movie like y'all see the yeah. real story y'all gonna see it opened up exactly okay. we're gonna open it up a little bit open okay. it up really see the story yeah. because there's a lot and I'm pretty sure I speak for C's and all of them too. I know that they would like to tell their side of the story because right. let's just be real about it. You know, his wife, his mom, and all them people who was running that movie, aside from Puff, were not around this man the way we were around this man. We were around this man every five minutes, every day. You uh-huh. know what I mean? Right, right. So I think our story would be a little bit more. It would feel more real. It would be more touching. It would be more like, okay, this is yeah. it. I mean, you know, to the to the naked eye who doesn't really know him, they're thinking, oh, it's a notorious movie, woo woo woo. Right. No, I mean, but you know. I think I think with with, with an artist of uh, uh, that of uh, that magnitude, you kind of do have to go in the backdrop of it. You gotta yeah. get you gotta get some of you gotta get some of those real stories really that okay. can help you connect to the character. You know what I mean? Like that that was the one thing I did feel like when I watched it, it was cool. Yeah. But you just like it was kinda like, yeah. yeah. It was like it was just kinda like a like I mean, a yeah. summary of everything really. Yeah, yeah, but for me it was more of a spoof because it just <laughs> a lot of times I watch things and I laugh. Like, this is freaking hilarious. Like, are you kidding? And I didn't I didn't watch every piece of the movie because I just couldn't. I mm-hmm. just couldn't sit through those. But I mean, you know, just the things that you know I saw, I'm like, oh, this is just dreading. All but right. You know, again, you know, it will happen the right way soon. I know the world will be, I think even the boys, like I said, D-Rock and everybody, I think they would even be proud of it. Because, I mean, I even heard Jada Kiss say, you know, he wasn't a B with the movie. And I'm going to tell you one thing right now, Big loved those boys. You know, right. he had a lot to do with the locks, you mm-hmm. know. So, it's just, it's just a lot, but... Yeah. Close by, someone heard it, nobody seen, nobody heard 